Shalom family, welcome to today. The verse I have for you is Ecclesiastes 5, 4. It says, when you make a vow to God, do not delay to fulfill it. He has no pleasure in fools. Fulfill your vow. God is the same yesterday, today, and forever. And he has complete control yesterday, today, and forever. Yet we humans harness God's power fully in the here and now. The enemy will do everything in its power to persuade us to do tomorrow what should be done today. I'll apologize to my sister next time I see her or I'll volunteer at church when work slows down. We tend to guise our procrastination as waiting for the perfect timing. But God's timing is the perfect timing. Of course, we should be prayerful in all things, and there will be times when God instructs us to be patient and to wait. But if we make a vow to God to do something, like read the Bible, repair a relationship, serve, give, fast, sacrifice, follow Yeshua, this verse says, do not delay to fulfill your vow. And if you make a vow and cannot fulfill it, you must repent. God's promises to us are unbreakable. He is bound to his promises. It's his promises that we cling to, that we put our faith into. So it should be no small matter when we make God promises and then procrastinate procrastinate or fail to fulfill those promises, fail to deliver on those vows. We might just blow them off altogether and not even say another word of it to God. So my prayer today is God give us the courage and wisdom to fulfill our vows without delay. I love you all. Have a blessed day. Shalom.